In Wigand v. Jackson Board of Education, white teachers with greater seniority were laid off in favor of retaining black teachers with less seniority. The court confronted whether the Equal Protection Clause permits a school to use race in deciding which employees to lay off. Although no court had ruled that the Jackson Board of Education had engaged in discriminatory hiring practices, the board began hiring more minority teachers in response to an investigation. However, when economic hardships arose, laying off employees using a straight seniority system threatened to reduce recent diversity gains. Through careful compromise, the teachers' union and the board negotiated a layoff provision in the collective bargaining agreement, which stipulated that the percentage of minorities laid off wouldn't exceed the percentage of minorities employed at the time of the layoffs. The board applied the provision, laying off Wendy Wigand and other white teachers. After minority teachers with less seniority were retained, Wigand sued the board, alleging an equal protection violation. The district court held that the layoff provision was constitutional. The Fourth Circuit affirmed. The United States Supreme Court granted Wigand's cert petition.